another five ball earmark just popped up. <laughs> I think, uh, I'm almost certain now. I think what happened here was the military was on to your scheme media. Like, they knew that y'all were up to something, and it was something real fishy. But, of course, they, they couldn't get into your board, right? So what they did was they used me to suck you in to me, right? And then I would be connected to your Borg, and little did you know, and I've said this before, little did you know, I was connected to their Borg, <coughs> which really isn't a Borg. It's, they don't use it like you do. They're not you know, weird like that. But uh, <coughs> I think when it was all said and done is exactly what's taking place right here. You know, how we were with the designer series, you know, how that was all, you know, that was a thing the whole time, like some sort of a designer series here. <laughs> I don't know what y'all were trying to design, but I'm pretty sure what the military has successfully designed was a military journalist, <laughs> like maybe the Army Times or something like that. Because, you know, I'm putting all these videos out there on uh, YouTube, and, you know, basically I got my own little Channel 7, we'll call it. And uh, really, at the end of the day, what I'm pointing out is <laughs> all y'all's follies. And I'm also pointing out to perfection a lot of, you know, military-minded shit here that y'all probably never thought of, obviously. <laughs> So, uh, you know, I don't really have a problem with you, media, but, you know, you did torture me. <laughs> I think the military's probably uh, really looking into that real close, especially if you look at the tweet that I'm going to post at the end of this. Well, it's just a picture of the tweet. Barry's already seen it a bunch of times, <laughs> literally. I tweeted it to him over and over and over again, but it pretty much paints the picture, and it was it, 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 it's not the exact tweet, but it's just a, a, a general looking at this Indian fella. And uh, it really, you know, like I said, we have our own way of communicating and everything like that. It's similar to y'all's. I think they finally picked up on your tactics in that way. And I helped them do that in order to whenever the time come around and there was a real journalist that was going to start telling the truth as to what all was going on here, that I would have this, uh, you know, I would be able to push to you their, you know, lingo and all that cool shit like that so you could get an idea <laughs> How this all kind of really spun around on you, you know. And I ended up being the only journalist here that was going to tell the truth, even though y'all wanted me to become one of you. Of course, that wasn't ever going to happen because I'm incapable of lying, you know. I just tell the truth all the time, which is probably why I'll never be a journalist. <laughs> But we'll see. Maybe that's all going to change. We'll see how that works out. I mean, obviously, everybody's under the gun in one form or another here because everybody's got guns pointed at each other's heads. Really, that needs to, like, get over with. I'm tired of having all the guns pointed at my head. Of course, the military's gun was... It didn't have any bullets in it. They were just making it look like they had a gun pointed at my head. And, and if it ever if it ever caught your attention that that might be the case. And the reason, you know, I'm not sure how all that went down. I think what it was was just a big old trap to prove what y'all did to President Trump. And in the meantime, while that was all taking place, they seen some value here that whenever this was over, I could tell my story and it would just be absolutely like annihilate everybody in the media and prove to y'all exactly what took place throughout this entire process. And I, it's just really, you know, they got they have my back. It's almost like they use me to rub it in on y'all a little bit. Of course, they had paperwork. So, you know, what can I say? <laughs> they owe me some back pay, though. I will say that. I mean, I got several avenues out there you can pay me anytime now. 